is the name of the show and what did you think? I thought it was wonderful, really thought provoking. It really was. Did you think you could use a sentence without using some of the letters that were in the show? Probably not, <laughs> that's for sure. But the writers have really done an amazing job of, of just writing that. Who could do that? That's crazy to think about and it's really, really cool. <laughs> so, Thank wow, you. It, was, it was really good. It was pretty fantastic. The music is amazing. I love it. You could talk using your name in a sentence without using the letter B. Talk in a sentence without using the letter that I'm not supposed to say, correct? <laughs> you did it. That's so awesome. And what did you think about Element OP? It's, I was going to use a word that starts with F, but I'm going to say wonderful instead so that I don't use that illegal letter. <laughs> we are so conscious of our letters tonight after seeing this show. Seriously, it's it's kind of magnificent what they are capable of. Oh, there's a B. Yeah, violation right there. There you go, right there. So what did you guys think of Element OP? Awesome, great story, so great. Okay, do you think you could say a sentence saying your name but not using the letter P? Atrick is here in the building. I'm Deborah Stavis. I'm with Third Coast Creative and I am one of the producers that's involved with the show. So it's because of you that we get to see this fantastic production of Element OP. The show is timeless and timely. What they talk about is a metaphor for what's going on in the world. You only have to look around to see that there are freedoms that are being taken away around the world and you know it's it's about something very important. Everybody in the whole wide world needs to see Element OP. Element OP. Most definitely. Yes. She speaks in third person, which she can explain. It gives her protection.